I've directed Metro Trains Melbourne to remove all Sky News content from the CBD stations, our public transport network, and I'm very pleased to see that not only have Metro Trains immediately agreed to that, they've also uh, indicated that they agree that the content that's screened on the public transport network needs to be appropriate for its passengers. People in their own home, using their own devices, using their own devices at train stations can watch whatever they like. But when when it comes to standing on a platform facing a big screen with content being shown, it's got to be content that's appropriate and that's why I've taken this action. Do you have any issues appearing on Sky News yourself? Well, um, I'm not sure if Sky News are here today. <laughs> so, uh, Sky, Sky are here. Certainly, if they, um, they uh, like any media outlet, have um, what is a really important um, right to uh, to cover public events, media events. But can I also say that this individual? has brought great damage to my home community of Bendigo. This individual made his national profile off the back of inciting hatred in my own community of Bendigo. When we were working through um, the issue a few years ago, the council, the City of Greater Bendigo, was working through an issue about granting uh, a permit to allow the construction of a mosque in Bendigo. What should have been a, a very straightforward planning decision allowing another religious institution to be established in the beautiful city of Bendigo became used as a tool to incite uh, racism and hatred and, and there were rallies in our hometown that brought great distress to my local community. And so that was deeply distressing enough. To then see these views and issues get raised uh, on a national platform, look, people can watch this in their own home. People can watch this on their own devices. I don't have a problem with that. But as the Minister for Public Transport, I feel I have a responsibility to take action when this sort of material is displayed on our public transport network.